Welcome to Aurora Chemistry for everyone. Let us analyze how to draw molecular orbital diagram of lithium molecule. According to molecular orbital theory, when atomic orbitals combine, they form molecular orbitals. There are two possibility of molecular orbitals, bonding molecular orbitals and antibonding molecular orbitals. For lithium molecule, it is formed by the combination of two lithium atoms. So lithium atomic number 3. So that electronic configuration 1s2, 2s1. Since lithium molecule has two lithium atoms, for another lithium atom 1s2, 2s1. So when these atomic orbitals combine, we get molecular orbitals. So here 3 electrons and here 3 electrons. So total in the molecular orbital, we should have 6 electrons. Here you can see that these molecular orbitals are arranged on the basis of their energy. So after filling that sigma 1s orbital, then only electron can enter into sigma star 1s orbital lithium molecule. So the total electrons 6. We can write that molecular orbital configuration sigma 1s 2 then after that sigma star 1s 2 then after sigma 2s 2 count the electrons 2 4 6 so 6 electrons we have so this is that molecular orbital configuration of lithium molecule using this we can draw that molecular orbital diagram Molecular orbital diagram is the graphical representations in which molecular orbitals are represented on the basis of their increasing energy. So let us draw that energy level diagram. 1s orbital. There are two electrons. In the same way, we go to draw for that another lithium atom also. So lithium 1s orbital. So in 1s orbital, we have that two electrons. So we go to show that same way here two electrons when these atomic orbitals these are atomic orbitals atomic orbitals when these atomic orbitals combine it will form low energy bonding molecular orbitals low energy bonding molecular orbitals and high energy antibonding molecular orbitals so this is low energy bonding molecular orbital this is high energy antibonding molecular orbitals first the electrons enter into low energy bonding molecular orbital so one electron from here another one electron from here it will enter now the remaining two electrons enter into antibonding molecular orbitals so now four electrons over for lithium atom 2s orbital same for another lithium atom also 2s orbital how many electrons we have that one electron here also we have one electron so that draw one electron same way here an, one more electron so when the same atomic orbitals when they combine the same way they form that molecular orbitals and antibonding molecular orbitals orbitals but in lithium atom in 2s orbital we have one electron and here also we have one electron so these two electrons combine in that bonding molecular orbitals what about this antibonding molecular orbitals this becomes empty now so this is antibonding or you can say that sigma star so this is sigma or bonding molecular orbitals now from this we can write that bond order whether this lithium molecule is stable or not the number of bond between the lithium molecule also we can find out bond order is equal to nb minus na by 2 nb number of bonding electrons na number of antibonding electrons by 2 so in bonding electrons we have the 2 4 electrons 2 plus 2 4 electrons and that in antibonding molecular orbitals we have only two electrons by two so two by two will get one since the bond order is one this 
lithium molecule is stable it is a stable molecule what is one there is a single bond between this lithium molecule now let us find out that whether it is a diamagnetic or paramagnetic that means magnetic behavior here you can see that uh, this all of them are paired electrons only we do not have that any unpaired electron so that uh, lithium molecule is diamagnetic in lithium molecule the bond order is 1 so it is very stable molecule the number of bond between that uh, lithium molecule is only 1 it means there is a single bond then magnetic property is diamagnetic thanks for watching